What's going on YouTube? It's Patrick Minton Outdoors. Alright, um, sorry there wasn't any video from Real Foot Lake. Went, got all the way up there, had all of our gear loaded in the car. I think I was taking pictures, uh, too. And got up to Real Foot Lake, which is about a three hour drive from here, and guess what? Left the battery for the camera at home. I've been snake bit so many times here lately on uh, getting any video out YouTube wise for different things but hey that's what it is I have a loner gun that's right um, good buddy of mine here local knows I have a YouTube channel and is very kind to loan me guns to review or look at or show you guys and um, He's he's the one that was possible for my Colt series where I did the snake gun uh, series. And any of the times you see the snake gun in a video of mine, it's from him. So, he is lucked up on something. And when I say lucked up, um, man, he got a hell of a deal on a gun. And, you know, couldn't pass it up, so... He let me bring it home. I've cleaned it up real good for him because it was on kind of the dirty side. And we took it, put 100 rounds to it downrange. Was going to video that. And I still didn't put the darn battery in the camera. But anyway, we have seen shooting videos and shooting videos. And I know we've seen review videos. But I want to show you this gun because it's, it's pretty. And it's pretty awesome. And love shooting it. And it just got added to my... I find a deal on it. I'm purchasing one. So, what is in the pistol case? Well, let's unzip it. How dirty. Anyway. Yeah. 1911. And this is actually a Ruger 1911 45 ACP. Isn't she pretty? It's a lot cleaner than it was when I got my hands on it. It still has a little bit, let's see if the camera will focus, 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 focus. Now, yep, there's still a little bit of rust right there. And I'm not through, I'm going to get it off of there before it's over with. But you see the rest of the gun, it is immaculate. And it was in good shape. It has two magazines with it. Um, I actually took the grips off and cleaned around. I mean, there was like a gunk all the way around the the grips that's no longer there so I did a major there's a couple little nicks here on the gun and it seemed like there was one more I can't remember where it was but anyway ah, this holster spot I guess it's a holster spot and there's some right there it looks like probably holster wear but outside of that the gun is gorgeous um, gorgeous gorgeous let me get her in frame we'll zoom down on her a little bit but um, it is 45 ACP um, it's a gorgeous gun it's a good shooting gun me and Chase both shot it uh, Saturday at the gun range and we we were chewing up some ammo with it I had no problems out of it no misfeeds no nothing um, it shot good it shot really well um, if, I don't know, if you want one, it's not, if you're looking for a 1911, it's not getting into the, um, um, what is it, like the Kimbers and that kind of price range. It's probably one to look at. Um, I've had no problems with it. I mean, this is not the first one I've ever broke down and cleaned. Uh, it's a 1911, okay? Everything's pretty much the same. It does have the GI guide rod and has the Novak sights. As you can see, those are still a little dirty. Sorry about that. Now we'll get cleaned up before it goes back to them. I see a little dirt there in the camera. The commander trigger. Of course, your normal safety, just on one side. And, of course, your uh, grip safety. And then your um, combat trigger. So, it's it's you know, it's got all the goodies on it. Uh, does not have night sights, just the Novak sights. And like I said, it does have the GI rod and uh, the wood grips. And it's a pretty gun. 
pretty pretty gun nice shooting gun comfortable shooting gun I can't believe I just did that I just ejected the magazine <laughs> and I'm not going to take it off there either I'm going to let y'all laugh at that I'll leave that on there um, but it does have the Ruger magazines um, it says made in the USA so I would assume that uh, Ruger makes their own magazines for their gun and um, so that's it pretty much uh, I do have another uh, I have a review on a gun that I shot a week or so back it's actually on video it's on YouTube right now I liked it so much I went and bought one so we'll go with that here a little later on down the road probably next week but I want to get this one out there to let you guys know I'm still out there um, you know my views are still climbing my subs are still climbing I hit 300 I'm probably going to do some kind of a cool um, giveaway uh, as much as I not a big fan of giveaways because of you know all of what it takes to go get them done but with winter coming on won't we'll have time so anyway check out this Ruger 1911 uh, 45 ACP killer gun um, I loved it we had fun with it got to take it back and anyway keep subbing keep subscribe or keep liking keep sharing keep doing all the good stuff you fans do and appreciate it be prepared